guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you five of my all-time favorite skincare products. So I've narrowed down five products that I've either been using for years and never want to be without, or they're new products to me that I've discovered and they've completely um, blown my mind. So if you're interested in that, then please keep watching. Alright, the first product that I'm going to talk about is probably the one that I've been using for the longest. Um, it's by La Roche-Posay and it's called the Effaclat Duo. Um, you can get this at the drugstore, which is awesome. I, I know Shoppers Drug Mart in Canada carries it, and I think CVS and Walgreens in the States do. Um, Dwayne Reed definitely does. So yeah, it's uh, called the Effaclat Duo, and it's essentially a pimple or acne treatment. Um, it's marketed, I believe, as a spot treatment, but you can actually use it. It's gentle enough that you can use kind of on a larger surface area. So this is probably the only pimple treatment that I use, um, and it's the only thing that I reach for when I'm having like some sort of situation or issue on my face. Um, I am very guilty of seeing like the tiniest little blemish and just attacking it until I've created something much worse. Um, and this seems to help with that problem. So if I've ever picked something on my skin, um, or if I have, I can see something coming. One of those like under the skin blemishes that never really comes out. Um, this is awesome. It's, um, it's a lotion. It's kind of like a clearish lotion. Um, and like I said, it's really powerful, really works, it really reduces redness and the size of the blemish and kind of clears up all the bacteria, but it's also gentle enough that you can use it on a larger surface area. So if I'm feeling like there's a specific area of my skin that's feeling really congested, like around my nose, or sometimes for me it's around my chin, I'll literally just slap this all over and like get it all over there and, and you know, hope that I wake up and it's all gone and usually it is. So um, this is an amazing product. I think I have about three right now. I usually keep like one in my gym bag, one in my travel bag, and then one at my makeup desk. Um, yeah, it's something that I'll never be without. It's made in France. French really know what's up when it comes to their skincare, so this is an awesome product. Up is another French skincare product. I did not plan that. Um, I started using this I think about three years ago. I picked it up when I was in Paris. It's by a French line called Umbrialise, and I started, I was introduced to the line, I started using one of their moisturizers, which I recommend to everybody, it's called the Umbrialise Light Cream Concentrate, and um, it's just a complete amazing moisturizer that should be a staple in everybody's skincare routine, I think. Um, but anyway, I was introduced to this product shortly after that, and this is essentially a hydrating face mask. So unlike traditional face masks that you would peel off or that you kind of would dry up like a clay mask that dries up and then you wash off. This is a cream mask so it essentially just looks like um, a really thick moisturizer and you apply it to clean skin. Um, oh, it smells so good. You know when smells like bring you back? I think I said that in my last video. The smell reminds me of Paris. Um, Anyway, you apply it to clean skin. It says on the, on the um, instructions that you can apply a thick layer and then remove the excess with, um, you know, a damp cloth. But I really like to use this overnight. So if I feel like um, my skin is really dry, which it usually is, I have dry skin. Um, or if I've drank too much and I have like hungover face that I need to combat, this really does the trick. It's super gentle and just really soothing and when I wake up in the morning my skin feels really nourished and plump and rehydrated and looks like I've been a good girl and I've been drinking all my water. So I love this product. Um, I believe that Sephora carries it now. Um, I will, I'll leave all that information in the bottom bar below but I know you can also get it online. Um, Umbrialise is not in drugstores here yet which is a bit of a shame but hopefully it will be soon. Next up is um, a retinol. This is the Glow by Dr. Brand Overnight Resurfacing Serum. I've been using this for probably about two and a half years. I was in New York um, about two and a half years ago and I was in Sephora where you can usually find me um, and I was talking to a sales rep about something completely unrelated and her skin was distracting because it was so incredibly glowy and beautiful um, and I stopped her and I was like okay hey, what like walk me through your skincare routine because your skin is incredible. Um, and she was like, okay, if you're going to buy one thing, buy this. Um, she started telling me about retinols and I had heard of them, but I wasn't really that familiar. Um, so if you're not that familiar with them, they're essentially a really concentrated form of vitamin A um, that are really great for resurfacing your skin. So taking away all that kind of dead um, excess skin, um, clogged pores are really great for reducing fine lines and wrinkles. 
evening hyperpigmentation, getting rid of like dark sunspots if you suffer from those. Um, so essentially retinol is kind of a miracle product that I will never, I will never not use now. Um, within, I, I got a sample of it that day and I want to say within about two days I noticed a difference in my skin just in the smoothness and like the evenness of my skin tone. Um, I also have a lot of pink in my skin. My skin's really sensitive to like touch and things so after I wash my face it gets really red. Um, and this definitely helps with that too. So uh, I love this product. Um, retinols are you want to be are a product that you want to kind of test out before you maybe jump in and buy the full size, which is why I maybe recommend going to Sephora and getting a sample of this. Um, this I believe is the highest percentage of retinol that you can buy over the counter. It's two percent. You can get higher prescriptions from dermatologists, but like I said, this one's over the counter, which is nice and easy. Um, so I apply this to my skin after I've cleansed, um, only in the evening. I'll apply a little bit, kind of press it into my skin, let it soak in, and then I'll apply my night cream or my oil over top um, and sleep with it on. I wouldn't recommend using this in the morning because it can make your skin a little sensitive to the sun. Um, and even when you're using it at night, I would definitely recommend wearing sunscreen. You should be anyway, but um, just be a little extra cautious when you're using a retinol that you are protecting your skin from the sun. Um, this product, unfortunately, is rather expensive. I think this runs you about $100, which is a little like, Ugh, but I promise it's worth it and it lasts you a really long time. I think that this probably lasts me anywhere from six to eight months. You literally need one tiny pump. It'll do your whole face. Um, and yeah, I love this product and I think I already have a backup of it. Okay, next up is this little guy. I think this is the smaller size of the two that they make. Um, this is by the brand Sunday Riley and it's called the Luna Sleeping Night Oil and this product um, when it came out on the market kind of like blew the beauty world up everybody was talking about it um, and so I obviously needed to try it because I would never pass up the opportunity to try a new product that everyone was talking about um, and it is essentially a retinol oil um, hybrid so this product um, is great in your evening skincare routine to use um, after you cleanse your face um, for me, this product is great for those days that I'm feeling really exhausted and all I want to do is kind of wash my makeup off and go to bed. Um, although I would never just do that because my skin would like dry up. Um, so I like to use this product. Uh, it's got blue tansy in it, which actually makes the, uh, the oil blue, which is a little scary looking. So, um, it comes out in this little pipette and like I said, it's bright blue. So another reason that I only use this at night is because it can make me look a little smurfy. Um, it doesn't, it leaves a bit of a blue cast on your skin. It does go away and it doesn't stain your bedding or your pillows or anything like that. It smells amazing. I love this smell. It smells like a spa. Um, so yeah, this product is awesome. It's really hydrating, but again, it has that retinol on it. So it's going to make sure your skin's staying really smooth and even. Um, it's going to help with redness and wrinkles and all of that fun stuff. Um, this product is again, pretty expensive. I'll leave all the information down below and you can get it at Sephora. Um, you can also get it online too. Um, but yeah, this is a great product and I really love it for those nights that I just don't feel like fussing around with, you know, my eight, my eight product, uh, skincare routine. So I love okay, this. Okay. I'm possibly leaving my favorite to last, which is exciting. So this is by Pixie. Pixie's a UK brand that is now sold in Target. Um, and Target now ships online to Canada, which is great for us. I think there's a few other websites that carry this too. Um, Anyway, it's called the Glow Peel Pads, and these are glycolic acid and rose water pads. They kind of look like oxy pads, if you're familiar with those. So they just come in these little um, kind of one-use pads. Pixie's really famous for a product uh, called the Pixie Glow Tonic. It's kind of their cult product, and it's um, essentially like a less powerful form of these that comes in like a toner that you have to put on a cotton pad. So these are amazing for traveling. And these are a really intense exfoliating treatment. So I love exfoliating my skin because I feel like I'm getting away like dead skin and, you know, bacteria and blackheads and all that gross stuff. Um, but I love these because they are really intense. Uh, they have a bit of a stingy factor, I will say, but that kind of good sting where you feel like it's working. Um, so you sweep them all over your skin after you've washed your face and honest to God, these make your skin glow like no other, like no other product I've ever used. I started using these and within a couple of days I was just like, wow, my skin looks 
bright and glowy and amazing. My makeup's sitting better on it. Um, and it's pretty rare that, I mean, for me, I try a ton of skincare products just because I love um, skincare so much. Uh, so it's pretty unusual that I try a skincare product and I immediately see a difference and I'm like, wow, this, you know, is actually doing something that I can see. Um, again, these are, I think these are fairly affordable. They come with 60 in, in, um, in this little tub and I think they run you about 24 US dollars. So really affordable. Um, I will say that because they do sting, be careful when you're using them on an, you know, an active breakout or sensitive area on your skin if you have, don't use them around your eyes. Um, but yeah, I love these. And another really interesting thing about these that I um, read recently is that it suggests to use them on the back of your hands, which I thought was a really cool recommendation. Um, as you might know, the backs of your hands are kind of one of the first places that show signs of aging. Um, so I usually take all of my skincare, I mean, on my face, down my neck, and on the back of my hands and kind of my decolletage as well. Um, I'm a little crazy. Um, but yeah, I think it's really cool that they tell you to use these on the back of your hands. So I, once I'm down on my face, I just take whatever's left and kind of rub it on the back of my hands and hope that that's preventing any dark spots or, or um, wrinkly hands in the future. Uh, also, uh, it says on here to um, to apply the um, the serum from the pad and then to wait a few minutes and rinse off the excess. I personally do not do that. I think partially because when I got these, I was so excited that I didn't read the directions and I just whacked it on my face and, um, and didn't wash it off. Um, so, I mean, maybe see how they feel on your skin. I have never had a problem with not washing the solution off. Um, I wipe them over my skin, I apply my night cream or my oil over top and go to bed and I wake up with really glowy, fresh skin. So, um, yeah, these are a definite win and I highly, highly, highly recommend getting your hands on those. All right, so those are five of my favorite skincare products. Um, like I said, my skincare routine is pretty evolving because I try so many products, but these five I really um, are kind of tried and true products that I have backups of that I continue to reach for. Um, so I hope you found that interesting. I'm thinking I might do um, a morning and evening skincare routine for you guys as well. So if you're interested in that, then definitely let me know in the comment section. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And I will leave all of the information about the products in the description bar below where you can buy them and how much they cost. Um, yeah, and I think that's it. So hope you guys are having a great day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.